To everyone watching this video, I say welcome to Let's Play Zoo Tycoon. This is the second advanced scenario, which is going to be called Mountain Zoo. I'm going to do Mountain Zoo first before African Savanna and Tropical Rainforest because I didn't need to do that much. The guest happiness counts as an objective and I want to keep the guests happy. So yeah, we're doing the Mountain Zoo. Yes sir, it's a uh, Black Hawk. I think Black Hawk, I think it's next to the Overlook Hotel. If you know what I'm saying, the Overlook Hotel. All right, so the state of Colorado has marked some property west of Denver in the foothills of the Rocky Mountains as a location for a new zoo. This zoo is intended to draw tourists who vacation in the mountains. You know, if they vacationed at the Overlook Hotel, let's hope it doesn't turn into a haunted house where I don't know. The goals are pretty straightforward. This one catch that much of the land has steep slope and flat space as at a premium. The biggest bet is to first focus on animals that are found in this type of habitat. Bighorn sheep, ibex, and markhor all fit in the Citeria. Citeria. can't pronounce that. Once you have the consistent flow of tourist income, Start thinking about selective places to level in order to give yourself a flat land for expansion. You know, I'm kind of thinking. As much as I like, I am interested in, um, you know, since this zoo is whole mountainy with a bunch of dirt and brown snow, it's a lot of brown stone, you know, brown stone, no dirt everywhere. So I decided that for the fact that, why is there a rainforest floor? I don't know. But anyway, um, what I'm doing is I'm going to get myself ready for Black Hawk, the Overlook Hotel, or the Overlook zoo. Let's hope there's not any Here's Johnny references or else it will scare the guests away. <laughs> Here's Johnny! <laughs> but anyway, I think I'm gonna start off with uh, Mountain Zoo, so let's get going. Oh, and guess what? We can hear that ambience from the Ice Age Zoo. Hear that? That's the same ambience. You get to hear it again. Ah, yes, this is just like Ice Age. Yep. Alright, let's start off. Okay, so, let's see. So I'm going to start off with something. You know, I might start off with, um... Geez. No, this low plexiglass fence. I want to, I want to make the zoo more, um, more bigger because, well, just the fact that we have dirt, so I think I'm going to proceed. 
African warthogs love dirt, so I'm going to place those little guys in, because they're pretty cheap. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, African warthogs are cheap. And look at that. Thorn bushes. I'm not going to talk that much because for the fact that I want to hear the ambience. I don't know if I'm ever going to put the compost building around here, but yeah. I mean, yeah, I'm going to... I think I might as well level some terrain. I think we need... I think we need at least five squares. Because I'm telling you that it's pretty sure that we may as well just, yeah. Okay, so, um, so we're going to put something in. It's going to be, um, the Japanese, oh, a guest saying, wow, look at that. There are a bunch of warthogs. I could put in Japanese Seiro because they just love mountains. Yeah, let's put in a Japanese Seiro. Uh, let's put it close to the the mountain terrain, just because we think that mountains are good for these. All right. All right. Too steep terrain. Okay. I can fix that. Not enough grass. All right. Uh, deciduous. I think they love deciduous. Yeah. All right. Okay. Oh, the train has to be less steep. All right. Um, fresh water. Fresh water. And gray stone. Okay. Damn it, I wasn't supposed to do that. 
I'm not leveling that. Their happiness is like 100%. Wow. And they like snowbell trees. Okay. And as you can see, that African warthogs give birth fast, which is why we did something pretty crazy for that matter. See those tiny little fellas? Alright, and we need... Yeah, they need more gray stone. Alright, I think that's plenty. Uh, deciduous. Grass. Alright, grass. And... Yeah, brown stone, apparently. And shelters. Concrete. And these. bunch of rocks is pretty much going to increase that suitability for those guys. I wonder. Still, 96. Oh, 96. Feeling crowded? Why are the warthogs feeling crowded already? They're not feeling crowded with... What the heck? I mean, there's like... 52 guests inside! Not feeling too crowded. What is going on here? You know what? I'm gonna place in the one and only Phoenix House. Uh, Phoenix House goes right here. Alright. So. We could just place in bighorn sheep or mountain lion. I think I might as. Just because I got a Japanese Seiro inside doesn't mean that I have to go ahead and, you know, or an Asian black bear. Or, uh, Kiang. I think I'll place in Kiang. Kiang sounds good for, uh, you know. You know what? I think I'll go with post rail fence. I think if I exhibited Lowland Gorilla, um,. Yeah, a lowland gorilla. That could be great, but I don't want to. Maybe later on. Alright, so snow. They like snow. Prefers, yeah. More clips. All right, so gray stone. All right, gray stone. And fresh water. Just level this terrain. Yeah. Too much dirt. This explains why I'm getting. Yeah, there's dirt all around, and yeah.
There we go. Alright. Uh, how much gray stone is there? Okay. Now they need Himalayan pine tree. I tell you, keying is just so... The keying is the largest of the wild asses. Asses? Jesus Christ, immature. Alright. Um, shelters. Jesus Christ, this so... This hill is... This is so mountainy. Yeah, I had to do that. Stable. Okay, stable. More rocks. Alright. Okay. There is some terrain I can just... I can place in the saltwater crocodiles since there's, um... There's some dirt and, you know, they love salt water. Just because salt water... Yeah. Yeah, let's put in salt water. Yeah. Alright. I gotta place in a bunch of salt water. Okay. Foliage. Okay. Water reeds. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need some more, more than that. Eh. Aha, an animatronic theater. I can put that in. No, 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 I can't put that in. Uh, uh, Jesus Christ, what am I going to put in right now? This whole... There's mountains everywhere. Level land required, you know. Snake pits. I can put those in. That's because if I would have interest. Alright, where is... I told you there's so much scenery around here, and I can't find the snake pit.
There it is. Elephant fountain. Yeah. that. And you see, this is why these African warthogs give birth so quickly. That's why. And those Japanese Saro guys, yeah. I could put in more Savannah. Yeah. It's just, hmm, I didn't mean to do that. It's just, there's so much mountain stuff everywhere. It's so mountainy, and yeah. Hello. Common wildebeest? Hmm. African buffalo, a hippopotamus. I mean, come on. Greater flamingo. Yeah, exhibit at least 15 different animal species. So I got Seru, Warthog, Croc, and, um,. I don't want to put in Lowland Gorilla just yet. Unless I get some more money. Or, of course, I may as well do that. It's just... Their toys are gorilla climbing bars. Alright. I may as well put in just... You know what? I'll put in a uh, common wildebeest. Might do that. It's because how about a grizzly bear how about that they love cliffs and hills to be exact for the fact that they yeah yeah Uh, no, we want deciduous. Okay. Water. Oh no. Exhibit's not big enough. Dang. What am I supposed to do around here? Sure, yeah. Yeah, I need to make the exhibit more bigger. Yeah, this is all I want. I think lowland gorillas would love that because they like mountains. I want deciduous. Yeah. Yellow cedar.
Yeah, you see that? My mouse does not click like it used to. It clicks too automatically, and it's just so annoying. Boy, these guys want more yellow cedar trees. Their suitability is going up very fast. How's the grizzly bear? Jeez, these grizzly bears are ill very fast. Mountain fever? What's going on? Do you have a mountain fever? You have a mountain fever for a grizzly bear, and that's just so silly. That's so silly. How does a grizzly bear have a... Oh my god, that, that zookeeper really needs to understand that, that, yeah, okay, we need another zookeeper, wow. Alright, there is some more terrain that I could, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I think American Bighorn Sheep would be nice. American Bighorn Sheep? A llama? I could bring in llamas, but I think I'm going to bring in just an American Bighorn Sheep, just because. Because, yeah. So let's see. Greystone needed. Alright. It only takes 24 months left, and we need to get at least 80 suitability for these exhibits. How much grass do they need? They only need just a little. Mm, fresh water. Okay, we need fresh water. Oh. Man, how much fresh water. I mean, God. Dude, this terrain is just so... Well, these bighorn sheep need... Ah, brown stone. So we need I'm not putting in a gorilla just yet. It's just yeah. All right, so they need sage bushes. Jeez, they need less sage bushes. And more rocks too. I don't know, but that grizzly bear sure had a mountain fever, which got ill pretty fast. Maybe grizzly bears didn't like too many of those crazy mountains. I know that... prefers an exhibit, but... I had to put the shelter inside. Who cares? Who cares, Mr. Zookeeper? There's nothing I can do for those guys. There's nothing I can do. Besides. Alright. Um, 
So let's see. We're gonna. Yeah, I know these guests are not going to have that much sight to see with those animals. Because only for the fact that, you know. Whoops, I, I don't want to do that. Alright, there we go. Now I think the guests will probably walk on these paths. Right. Look at those horses! Those mountain horses are just so babe awesome. We'd like to. You already have a mate, Mr. African Warthogs. Maybe we'll put in a rock window fence for the guests to look at the Saro sheep. Yeah. And the bear, too. The grizzly bear. We need to increase that guest happiness, because now, this is why I couldn't get too much of it earlier. I mean, yeah, I think I like, I like, I like scenarios without the um, objective where you need guest happiness. Okay, so... I just love that... I just love that ambient sound effects. But I can still hear the, uh the ambience from all those guests. Yeah. So I have uh, Warthogs, that's number one, Sheep two, Grizzly Bear four, Saro five, Kiang six. Wow! The exhibit is not going to be big enough for all those crocodiles, nor the Warthogs. I'm not going to put in lowland gorillas until I'm going to get that cash bonus. Cuz, it's just a matter of time since, you know... Yeah. It's all that I'm talking about too, you know what I mean? Dude and dudettes of Ricky Dins. Some dimmy duckies go quacky. Whoop. Whoops. Didn't mean to mess around with the terrain. Um, the American bighorns. Sweet. Sweet and rolling. We're rolling. I put in the Japanese garden already. Just like I placed in. I don't understand why that Phoenix house does not have a name. Those African warthogs gave birth too fast. That's why they're so popular and so incredible. I put in a bunch of bighorn statues for the fact this is going to be a scenario with a bunch of mountains. You know what I mean? Alright, so, um... Guess what? They've given birth to that one sheep. I could... 
I mean, the lowland gorilla is the only rainforest animal that likes uh, all these hilly cliffs. Because, yeah. And Bigfoot, well, Bigfoot is like $10,000. That's insane. I can't put in Bigfoot. That's like $10,000. Tell me. The Tourette's guy has always been mentioning about Bigfoot. Who gives a about Bigfoot? Men's duckies. You know that Tourette's guy? Yeah. But maybe when I... I might place in a lowland gorilla. It's just lowland gorillas. Yeah, I got that cash bonus. Cool. Okay, I'll place in lowland gorillas, but rainforest bushes only. We gotta give them all the rainforest they need. And I'm not putting in elephant ear trees because they require mm, flat land. All right. All right, so they like the concrete shelter. Too steep. Train in the exhibit is too freaking steep. Still too steep. What's going on? All right, we'll put some grass in. Who cares? And we need to get rid of the brown stone also. More rainforest, okay, more rainforest. There is enough room for the gorilla climbing bars. All right, rainforest bushes. Because I can't put in elephant ear trees. I can place in these rocks. Not happy. Those gorillas are gonna go wild. They're gonna just beat up their own craziness. It's the terrain. Why is the terrain too steep? Why is the terrain too steep? For goodness sake. Too steep. Still. All right. Okay. All right. Yeah, only 86 suitability. That's the reason why we can't get that much. 
much. And that zookeeper. Alright, I think I might save Mountain. From now on, Mountain. Just because lowland gorillas love their hills doesn't mean that. Next will be my animal theater, which I'll place in. But we got a little some terrain. Just because. Yeah. Just in case if we get the cash bonus for when the gorilla gives birth, I will get ready and research animal houses. Just knowing how rock hard this, uh, this scenario gets when you know it'll rock you like a hurricane. Get it? Here I am, rock you like a hurricane, dude. You know what I mean, right? Oh boy. And I hate it when gorillas are not happy. Well, just because their terrain is so steep and they only like low land. Yeah. I love how lowland gorillas just enjoy their own hills, but not too steep. Alright. So animal theater is placed inside. Right. Zoom map will be placed right here. Apparently. A water well. Jeez. A water well. How oh, am I gonna. There we go. Okay. Okay. I had to level all this terrain for the fact that, yeah. Don't tell me that I had to go ahead. You better not fall into that bighorn sheep's exhibit.
All right, so let's see. What's our next one? Himalayan Wolf. Uh -uh. I could place in... Um... You know what? I'm going to place in a wild Przewalski's wild horse. I just love them Przewalski's wild horses. They're just so cool. I love them. And we already got some gray stone for those Frizwalski's wild horses. Need to bring in the dirt, the fresh water. Not enough gray stone. Alright, so we need not enough dirt. Okay. So stable. Stable. And the broadleaf bushes. Where's all that brown stone? And stone. There's some brown stone. And uh, more rocks. Okay. We don't have any grassland rocks. Nuh uh. Okay, so let's see. Not placing in the, um, uh, that Lococo Lounge. Not placing in the, um, not placing in any of this. It's all copyright music, you know. I'm telling you. I think a petting zoo will be good. I could get a, you know, gorilla climbing bars. Gorilla climbing bars? Yeah. But I, it's just, yeah. I think my next mountainy exhibit will be uh, llamas. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I only have eight. Sorry I had to do this, guys, but... But this is all I had to do. I want to have enough money for my next exhibit. I could take, I think llamas look nice. Llamas are nice. How about that?
gray stone. And foliage. They like western juniper tree. Okay. Western juniper tree. Rocks. And... Oh, they need more... They need more gray stone. Do they? I'm gonna run out of money pretty soon. Gray stone. So they llamas need shelters. Okay. Man. Yeah, it's just. Fresh. Dude. All right, you know what? I'm putting in this concrete shelter. Golly. All right. Dude. Where am I going to put all the fresh water in? There's no way I'm going to put fresh water inside because... Alright. Well, llamas, I have to do this. I don't care about the animals of the same type. It's just... Gray stone, gray stone. Yeah. Just wait until we breed those gorillas. And quite possibly, yes. Flattening all this terrain would do. Too freaking steep. My tushy. What? Screw it. I'm not... I'm not fooling around with the terrain. It's just... Who cares? Your suitability is fine. Don't look at me, buddy. And that freaking poor grizzly bear is just... Why is... 
That grizzly bear is getting ill. I don't know. I think it's because the, um, yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking we may as well just... Sorry, grizzly bear. There we go. I think that's good. Okay. I think because the yellow cedar trees are blocking the little pathway, I'm trying to get the zookeeper to um, please. What the heck? Zookeeper? Oh my god. Oh my god, you're being an absolute... Why? Why? I had to remove those yellow cedar trees because they were blocking the way for the zookeeper to heal that grizzly bear. Oh my god. Da Mati Kopi Jesus Christ, that zookeeper is just so negative. Alright. Okay, there we go. I don't care about animals of the same type, I just want to... Jesus Christ! Alright, so we got Kiangs. One, two, three, four, five, six, to seven, to eight, to nine. Okay. That's pretty neat as it is. Alright, and next would be an animatronic theater. I can place that in. That one. Such as this one. Alright, I'm gonna save this. Save it all up, because I love saving. I just love how that gorilla is dancing. I love how that gorilla's dancing. Love the way gorillas dance. They're like dancing dudes. I think the reason why Grizzly Bear gets sick so fast, it's because due to a mountain fever. I think the Grizzly Bear gets a mountain fever. I think because Grizzly Bears do not like mountains. I think because Grizzly Bears don't like mountains. That's why. Yeah, that's the reason why. I'm not waiting until Lowland Gorilla gives birth. That way we could just, you know, place in another exhibit. No, I'm going to put in Siberian Tigers. Yeah. Siberian Tigers may do very nice. Rock Window Fence, apparently. My zoo runs low on money. I'm gonna be skewered. I'm telling you. You know, um, a Siberian tiger, apparently. Hmm. 
we're just trying to get to make more profit and yeah elephant ride and yeah, due to insufficient funds it's just So, fully punch needs to vanish. I'll place the hotel right here just because. And, you know, I'll put in just vases from Rainforest. I mean, just because we're in a mountain zoo means I'm gonna put in another bighorn statue for everybody else. It would have been better if I just made this more terrain. You could just do that. You know what? I think I don't need to put in American Bighorn Sheep. I think I may as well just put in Ibix. I think Ibix will do. It's just Ibixes are alright. Just because. Like Himalayan pine tree. We got ten different species. Cool. Alright. How's the terrain? Okay. Fresh water. We move this ibex out of the way. All right, gray stone. Cool. Grass. Put some grass in. Okay, can the zookeeper hurry up? Do you know? Sorry guys, it's just... Alright, get over here and do your damn job and help the bighorn. While I give the gray stone to the ibex. Alright. A shelter. I can take that. So concrete like. Oh, great. I had to do this, guys. Just. Highest quality confirmed. And I'm in debt, which is not pretty cool. I'm low on money. Trying to get some rocks inside for the um, 
Alright, I'm selling that guy. Sorry about this. But I have to go ahead and do place the rocks in. I know it's pretty terrible of me to sell the babies, but in King, but this I had no choice. Alright, I gotta I gotta give them the gray stone. I don't know why, but they have too much brown stone. Alright. I know they want animals the same type, but I'm not doing that right now. Stone obelisks, I can place those in. Atlanta, Atlantia of Large Archway, I can place that in. So I'd like to say Ibexes are very nice for those guys. So, what's our next one? I think got some of this leveled train, and yeah, this train looks all leveled. I'm pretty sure we'll, you know, do what we'd like to do best, and Alright, so let's see here. I can place in, um. Oh. Barbary Lion. I cannot do that. Barbary Lion. I may as well save up that cash completely. Elephant Ride. I can do that. Elephant ride. Let me make some... No, how about Siberian... Siberian tiger. How about that? Siberian tigers will do perfectly. It's just... But... Apparently Markor instead, since, you know, we got Markor and yeah, Markor will do nice. I'm looking to see that if the lowland gorillas give birth, we'll be sure we'll get more money. Just because. Markors will do nuts. You got snowy terrain, and I can do that. Hey! Or Himalayan Wolf. Well, Himalayan Wolf. Dude. I'm not gonna be able to. Sorry, I had to do something that's not going to be very good for me. Uh, yeah. I wonder, can do Himalayan wolves love terrain? I'm going to save this. Do they love snow?
me see. Prefers an exhibit. Yeah. No, you know what? I'm going to go for Markor instead. We have hills, so yeah. And they have a bunch of needs for mountains. Well, yeah, it's just those markors can be pain in the neck, I tell you. Ah. All right. You know what? We need snow. And fresh, fresh water. need more snow. Grass. Okay, grass. Foliage. I don't know which other of this is. What the hell? Hey, just because that we need more than that, it's I don't know. You know what? How about um how about just the sage bush? I think I'm gonna go for sage bushes. And you know what? These markors are like so crazy, I tell you. They act like crazy pigs. Go winky doinky ma. So they want tuck me in because those mark whores are not getting happy. shelter. Need more rocks. Where's all that brown stone coming from? Brown stone, brown stone, brown stone. Corn sheep's giving birth. They need more clips. They need crazy clips, do they? Mm. 
Yeah, a bunch of crazy clips for the fact that they're just crazy. They have crazy faces. Those markors have crazy looking faces. Yeah, these markors are not happy. Why is my voice cracked? And I missed out on wanting to place in those holiday trees because I've been messing around with the freaking terrain in the markor exhibit. May as well put an elephant ride. Oh, Markor ain't happy! Jesus Christ! How much suitability does it take to give you guys more happiness? Prefer um, more rocks. Oh, yes. Yeah, I don't know. These markors are freaking crazy. This is crazy. All right. You know what? I think I may as well give more suitability for those mark wars. I don't care about the large amount of foliage. I decided we need more than that. So that's cool now. Okay. I'm telling you guys, markors are freaking crazy! Anything else before I end this video? Cause... 12 months left. I tell you. Alright, so we need at least, um... Um, exhibit suitability. So we have 11 animal species. So we have warthogs, sheep, bear, ibex, Cerro, Kiang, Llama, Gorilla, Markor, Horses, yeah. So you have... Alright, so we have at least, um... 
11 species. Now we need 12 more. Okay. All right. I'm going to save the video and I'll get back to it pretty soon. This is Ron Livingstone. I'll see you guys next time. Haha. -ha.